Welcome to Fox Tech. In today's video, I'll guide you through a few steps to troubleshoot and fix the issue when Face ID isn't being recognized on your iPhone. Now, Face ID problems often pop up if there's been some kind of repair or replacement done on the phone. This isn't always the case, but it's pretty common. So if you're buying a secondhand iPhone, it's a good idea to check that Face ID works before you commit. However, sometimes the issue can just be a hardware glitch or wear and tear over time. So let's dive into a few steps to get it working again. First, start by making sure your iPhone is running the latest version of iOS. Apple frequently updates iOS to improve compatibility and fix issues. So head to settings, tap on general, then software update, and install any updates available. This might resolve the problem if it's related to software. Next, take a look at the true depth camera area, which is at the top of the screen. Sometimes dirt, smudges, or even a small scratch can interfere with Face ID. Clean it gently to make sure it's clear of any obstructions that could be blocking the sensor from accurately reading your face. Once that's done, go to settings, tap on Face ID and passcode, and make sure that Face ID is enabled for the specific functions you need, like unlocking your iPhone. This might seem basic, but it's worth double checking in case Face ID was accidentally disabled in your settings. For the best recognition, make sure you're positioning your face within 10 to 20 inches from the camera. If you're too close or too far, Face ID might struggle to recognize you correctly. Another useful step is to reset Face ID entirely. Go back into Face ID and passcode settings. Choose Reset, Face ID, and go through the setup process again. This can help recalibrate Face ID if it's having trouble recognizing you consistently. A simple restart can also work wonders. Hold down the power button, swipe to turn off, wait a few seconds, then turn your iPhone back on. This can refresh some settings and may help clear any minor glitches. Additionally, certain accessories, like some types of sunglasses or face coverings, can interfere with Face ID, especially in low light. Try removing these and see if it helps. If you've tried all these steps and Face ID still isn't working, it might be time to contact Apple support or visit an Apple store. There could be a hardware issue with the true depth camera that needs professional attention. Thanks for watching, and if you found this helpful, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to Fox Tech for more iPhone tips. See you later.